This is Namibia, a country I call home, 500 kilometers north of Vintuk, near a town of Tsumeb, is a site that has mystified visitors from all around the world. In this part of the country lies one of the only two lakes found in this arid landscape. It is called Lake Ochikoto, a legendary lake which is believed to hold the secret to Kaiser's sunken gold. The secret treasure remains a mystery many have tried to solve but failed. Lake Ochikoto is an underground living museum and holds a mystery from the dark days of World War I. According to the legend of the Sun People, the lake mysteriously appeared from what used to be a popular spot for picking wild berries. One morning, when they all returned to pick wild berries, they found the earth caved in, forming a large and deep water-filled lake. Legend has it that whoever dares to swim in the water will disappear forever. In 1927, a local postman dived into the Lake Ochikoto and disappeared without a trace. His tombstone was laid in his memory. Well, science has it that Lake Ochikoto was formed by rainwater gradually eroding the earth and at its weakest point, the walls caved in, forming the lake in return. According to various local folklore, Lake Ochikoto does not dry up because of the underground river running through it. It is believed to be the same stream that connects the lake to Lake Guanas because of the same tilapia species only found in both lakes. Curiosity has it. Many of you will be asking this question by now. How did Kaiser's lost gold legend come to be? Well, according to Namibian history, around July the 18th, 1915, the defeated German army in German Southwest Africa at the time wandered in secret and dropped their weapons in the lake including their prized possession, which is believed to be the safe which contains the treasured gold. After its defeat and the German troops taken as prisoners of war, the British and South African army began a salvage operation to retrieve the treasure and ammunition. These were the really dark days in Namibian history. A history that's not forgotten, but remembered and should be told through the honest eyes of our youth. Over the years, various scientists have traveled to Namibia to uncover Kaiser's lost gold at the bottom of the mysterious lake. Despite possibilities of precious metals lying beneath the lake, there is lack of compelling evidence about the remains of the allured treasure. However, their ambition did not end here. Various salvage operations carried out on the lake uncovered military artifacts and some of these pieces can still be found at the bottom of the lake, as well as the Tsumeb Museum located about 20 kilometers away from the site. Exploring Lake Ochikoto is not an expedition for the faint of heart. 
The sloppy ledges lead into pitch darkness in a maze of tunnels, caves, and underground streams. Today, the entire property around Lake Ochikoto is a popular local and tourist destination because of its history. Artifacts such as the place where the peace treaty was signed to the tombstone of the departed divers can still be found in perfect restoration. Okay guys, tell us, would you visit this legendary lake? On the list of the must see and do things in Namibia, do not forget to put Lake Ochikoto. The mystery and a law is very exciting and I'm sure you might really be interested in exploring it. I have so many exciting videos to share with you. So if you find this video interesting, do subscribe and click post notification. This will enable you to get an alert that we've uploaded the next video. Goodbye besties.